All right, everybody, Evolved Mentality is coming back at you with another mathematical equation that's going to wrap your brain around the game. Uh. So uh, this is due to the Doom video that I put out a couple of weeks ago. Obviously, other people are picking up wind of it now and realizing that this is actually going to be a problem. There's this kid, and I'm just going to say a name for once, uh, Brother Chris, because I'm going to be citing him in this video. And uh, he, you know, did a video after mine. I'm pretty sure he just has somebody in my Discord that, like, fed him the information, finally. But <gasps> the point is, um, I said it first, been saying it been knowing it come follow me like and subscribe because i mean i made these predictions months ago right so i deserve it um and this problem gets amplified again because of the fact that we've had this padded amount of resources brought into our economy but anyways let's just get into it um i do want to let's change the camera size uh, i gotta remember to do this more often in videos because um, i'm not the important part here the math is the important part but before we even get into that i want to show you guys real quick i uh, just i've never done this before but i want to cite my work okay so we're going to flash something on screen. Every single one of these tabs, I put a lot of work into this. I mean, like, a lot of work into this. So please hit that like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video, because I put a ridiculous amount of work and research into this. I've never I've never put this much research into a video. I usually can just kind of do the math in my head. This took a lot. Like, this took a lot, because there's a lot of ifs, ands, ifs, ands, ifs, ands, ifs, ands, ifs, ands, ifs, ands, blah, 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 blah. So anyways, TLDR, um, you're fucked on Arrayas. Whether you like it or not, no matter what kind of stupid, dumb scheme, math bullshit, or whatever that guy said way back in the day, mental gymnastics, you're trying to play with me here, you're fucked, it doesn't matter. So anyway, let's, uh, let's just get right into it, okay? So first off, um, I took, I basically did all of, I took stats and, and data from everywhere. So he, this isn't the only video that I watched for this information. Um, I also looked up uh, the Reddit on it, and I read the Reddit on it. I uh, looked at the pictures to see what the productions were. I used... Um, this concept here to see how many you could actually produce and uh, how many you got. So I used a shit ton of data all across the board. Um, I looked up, this is data on basically how many characters have, how many people have, what their rosters look like, like how many 1580s does somebody have per roster, so to say. Um, I obviously pull up in uh, the Steam charts to see, you know, what our peak players are. It's 40,000, but I did 35,000 because I felt like that was a little bit more accurate. Um, so I play with the numbers a little bit here to make things what I believe more accurate, but I also really pad it too just to make the point. So I just want you to know that even if we did 40,000, it won't make that big of a difference. It actually, it's, it doesn't matter, right? So just please trust me on this and you can go do the fucking math yourself. I know there's going to be a lot of people that are going to hip check this, but what's funny about this is when I did the math on the Chaos Dungeons, you guys used to hate and, and nitpick it to try to make it less than what it actually was, right? And I would always bring it down, bring the bar down for you. And I already know that this video, you guys are going to try and spike the numbers to say, no, we produce more than that. Ha 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 ha. I have a master craft fucking fishing rod and I produce more than that. So I'm waiting for that too. That's fine. Go fuck yourselves. It doesn't matter. We're doing this based on the averages. So again, I took data from everywhere. I literally took data from everywhere. I looked at a bunch of different videos. I saw what people were producing. I just want to cite my work here. I want you guys to understand. Obviously, I use Max Rule for the calculations of what we're going to need. Because um, I've, I've never done this. Um, I actually cite Chris here twice because there's two aspects that I needed from him. Um, for this video, I actually just stole the amounts that it takes to make each one because um, I couldn't find it. And I know we had it somewhere. And I, do, um, I want to cite one more thing. Um, I'm, I'm not exposing my buddy's investment by doing this, uh, cause I blacked out his name actually. But anyways, we've been talking about this and I just want to show you how good at predicting shit we are, um, in our, in our group. And we haven't really been putting it in the discord, discord stock chat as much anymore because we know that there's a couple of kids in there that are just there for the information. How do I know? Because my subscriber count didn't go up as much as the discord count went up. Um, so you guys aren't actual supporters. You're there to just kind of steal the info from us and then go bring it to your little buddies. And that's cool. That's fine. We're trying to help the community at the end of the day, but it's fucked up. It's fucked up. So you, a lot of you, because of my subscriber count, right? 20% are subscribed that watch my videos. That means 80% of you are watching my videos just to take the information from me. But because you don't like me as a person, you won't support me. That's disgraceful. All right. And I'm just going to say that here. Um, I don't give a fuck if you like the length of this video. It's great information. So if you don't stay, that's your goddamn problem, right? But anyways, I just wanted to show this. Uh, we've been talking about this. This isn't just me another citing my work. We've been talking about this for a while now. Okay. This goes pretty far back between me and him. I believe the first messages that we had on it were um, this one, all right? Yeah, 712. So the, the first messages were August 1st, all the way back to 712, where we were talking about this array of concept. So I just want to make it perfectly fucking clear. I'm going to pull one more thing on screen that if you go and you look at other people's market predictions, 
All right, two things that I want to bring up here. There's two things I want to bring up. I want to bring up my own videos really quick, and this is validation for myself. If you don't like it, you can fucking skip to the part that matters, but I'm not putting timestamps in this. You want the information, you listen to my damn words. They're coming out of my mouth. Oh, uh, but anyways, um, the first fucking calculation and or prediction, or the second one is this one, right? It came out on August 1st. That was the first time that I made a video on the gold, the market predictions. The first time that I talked about the Array concept was this right here on August 10th. The first time that I made the actual market prediction, though, where I said that this was going to be the problem, it was going to happen. If you want to go watch this video, it was this one right here on June 4th. Okay, so I said it on June 4th, all right? I just want to point this shit the fuck out, because I said it first. I've been done, said it. Okay? And that's who I am. I don't care. I want the credit. I really do. I'm a vain-ass person. I know I probably won't get it, but I do. I want the goddamn credit. I deserve it. I deserve it. I've been guiding people for over a year, and I haven't gotten the credit, and I could have guided more people towards a better account if you guys would have just fucking listened to me instead of fighting me on everything, because you could have helped me make this better. But anyways, on August 10th was when I put out that prediction. Now let's go check out Brother Chris. I just, I'm not even trying to be a dick here. I'm just saying it like it fucking is, right? Um, so let's go ahead and get in here. Uh, he talks about the Array thing three days ago, right? Let's go ahead and see what the date was for the video. The date for the video was... It doesn't tell me what the date for the video was. August 25th. August 25th. I did it almost two weeks sooner than this kid put the video out, but you guys are watching this kid every week for his, his economics thing. And I'm not trying to throw hate or throw shame, because this kid hasn't talked crap about me in any videos or nothing like that, right? So there's no reason for me really to hate on this kid right now. But the reality of it is, is that... You guys are listening to people who have no idea what the fuck they're talking about in the stock market. They have no idea how to, to figure out trends and things like that. I'm predicting this shit months in advance, and then you guys watch people like this. I don't encourage you not to watch him. I watch him. I would like, though, to steal some of their viewer base. You're watching Zeals and, and these Koreans who have had uh, content for, for years. They've had the game for years. It's not actually impressive that they figured out a lot of this stuff over a period of three or four years. So I'm, I'm figuring it out on the fly, all right? Anyways, let's get into the video, because I'm, I'm not, otherwise I'll sit here and brag all fucking day. But all right, I'm going to X out of this. Don't save it. I just This is just me validating, like, we've been talking about this shit for a while now. Okay, but now you can't fuck up his investment because it's already too late. So it doesn't matter. So now I can expose it. And I didn't put his name in because he asked me not to. Now this is the, the creme de la con. Okay, this is exactly why we're here. I'm also going to X out of all my work cited on the left, because I don't need all that shit. And it's just slowing down the computer. Um, all right, where to begin here? This is something I didn't really have, actually. I don't really uh, know where to begin. I could just jump to the end and give you the fucking TLDR of all of it. Um, but yeah, so I guess the TLDR is that we are not going to be able to produce. We are not going, and I padded the numbers to aid your fucking process. We are not going able, being able to produce the amount of arrays that we're going to need based on the max roll. Okay, and you can just go ahead and corroborate all of these numbers at the end. I'm just going to kind of flash over things and show you where I'm at. Okay, this will help me. Uh, maybe not that. Okay, is there anything I can use... I should use the on-screen painter, right? But instead, I'll, I'll use this, and I'll draw green bars over things, right? Um, yeah, that works. So, basically, I want to start off and say that uh, the beginning of the math here is I had to go to the Steam charts, and I had to get the player counts, okay? So, 35,000, right? And we're going to hit a lot of alt Zs. And then the next piece of math that I obviously needed was the energy that we use, okay? So, just kind of follow along with wherever I'm doing this. Uh, we needed energy. And then I did this. I assume that every player does trade skills, which we already know is a massive fucking padding to the stats because the majority of us don't do them. Period. The end. Most players don't do their trade skills, especially at the top end where I'm at, where we're producing so much gold on our account that we'd rather just buy them. It's easier, right? So again, this is assuming the players buy them. Uh, do their trade skills. And that doesn't mean buying a, a trade mats and making arrays. So that has nothing to do with this. This genuinely has with the production of fucking fish in the game. Okay. And we had that in the works cited. If you look at back at the beginning, you can see some of those links were works cited on how much you produce per 10,000 slash 11,000 energy used. Then you do the math on uh, in, in, a, in a full week. It's 55 hours to recover. It's like 10 minutes per 30 energy or whatever. So if you do the math backwards, it's essentially you'll have three full energy bars a week now with that in mind what you're able to produce in a week is about this this is what you can produce per roster in about a week you'd be able to produce about 600 to 780 superiors about 1800 basics and about 405 primes a week okay that was the math that i got you don't like it go check it and fucking prove me wrong you're not going to i just spent hours doing this shit uh these are the ratios over here okay of what it costs this is the average production per week okay 
uh, or I believe cycle. Yeah, per cycle, per energy cycle. So this is the average production per energy cycle. These are the costs just above it on what you would need to, to make them essentially, right? Um, and if you look, or I lied. This is the cost per week to do this, right? To be able to make that many per week. This is the raw mats per 11,000 energy. So I just want to draw that out. And then this, unfortunately, kind of spread it out a little, is per 15, per 20, per 30, what you actually need to make them, like the cost of them. So I have it a little bit all over the place, and I apologize for that. But I tried to, I tried to picture this in my head and then draw it out the best way I could. Okay, and this wasn't easy. It was extremely difficult because I am taking a complex fucking equation here and simplifying it for you monkeys. <clears throat> and this shit was hard, okay, even for me. And I'm relatively intelligent. I really wish I had my friend Korea right now because he probably could have came up with a way to make this... So much simpler, um, but that's okay because complicated work sometimes too. <laughs> so then I wanted to take the player base and I had to break down the player base to be able to do this. So I broke the player base down at first into a 60-20-20 split, meaning 60% of us were at the top, 21,000 players um, right here. So 60, this is where I did the breakdown, uh, just so you can see kind of where I'm talking about it, right? And that's assuming that one one roster equals one character, which it doesn't. Again, we found out that the average player has about three 1580s and three 1540s on their account, like that range-ish, right? So basically three in the prime array range, three in the superior array range. And that's why eventually I actually cut the basic arrays because there's no point. We're actually, we overproduce those. So people are like, oh, players are smarter than they used to be and they prepared for this. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. You know how I know they didn't? Because they overproduced the fuck out of basic arrays. That's how I know they didn't. Anybody who was still making basic arrays or superior arrays in the last couple of months overproduced the amount of volume that we would need for the entire economy to be able to progress forward, the entire ecosystem to progress forward. That's how you know that people aren't smarter than they used to be. <clears throat> Copying is not the same as intellect. Knowing something is not the same as knowing how to use something. <clears throat> Fuck. This is going to be an angry video, I'm sorry. Or at least a passionate video. I don't know why it always gets written off as anger. It's not anger. It's like that you want to add an emphasis to something. It's like saying fuck before something. I fucking love it compared to I love it. God, get with the program, brother. Anyways, back on point. Back on point. So what I did is I took that math and I did 35x, 35,000 players, what they would basically need. Uh, and I, I, this is the one part I don't like. I kept putting weak, like I kept putting the need every week and i fix that later but for right now just just ignore it um this is essentially how much you would be able to produce a week if you only if our whole entire community only made this uh made superiors basics primes this is if the whole community was making it which they can't okay but because you need a 1580 to even make these but anyways we did the math on it anyways we figured why not you'd be able to produce about 14.1 million and the reason why i did it anyways is because you're gonna laugh when you see the numbers at the end um and how short we actually are okay but then, so I broke it down. I broke it down into that 60-20-20 split. And if you did a 60-20-20-20 split, which is right here, oof, whatever, you can just kind of read now that I've, I've hovered over it, right? So you know where I'm looking. I'm going to do it one more time just so you guys know where I'm looking. This split here in this middle region of the pyramid, or let's actually keep the box on it so you can stay with me. This middle region, right, where we're at, basically what it's saying is that if we produced 12.6 uh, million a week, um, you would... Uh, if you produced 12 point million a week, sorry, um, I also fucked this up now that I'm looking at it kind of. Yeah, I did fuck this up a little bit. But anyways, now uh, if you produce 12, uh, 12 point6 million a week, you would actually have the cost of 13.3 million a week. And granted it's not in a week, so that's why I'm saying we kind of overproduce these actually now that I look back at it. but the concept is, is in a four month, I use four month period of times for all of this for the requirement because every piece of content is relatively four months out for the most part. That's how it's kind of been. Voldyke is four months out or Voldyke, so whatever. Um, it would be about 226.6 million that you would need um, and you, you wouldn't produce it. You wouldn't produce it. I forget what the math was, but they don't matter, okay? We're just we're not going to talk about basic arrays and that's why I stopped doing the math for them because I started realizing like we're, with the volume in the market for these is so fucking high that we'll probably never run out of them actually. And uh, that's a bold statement but probably true to be fair especially because you got to consider how many people have alts beyond six characters where they're just making crazy shit like that like me the other day i went through about five thousand of these in a single fucking day um anyways 
So then we're going to talk more about these numbers because these numbers are the numbers that we're all really worried about, right? And this is still with a 60-20-20 split. So I'm not going to talk about this range of the pyramid because this range of the pyramid is still putting 20% of it towards basic areas. So we're going to actually just ignore that now. That was math that I had to do to get to this point though. So I just think it, it does help. And it's also only assuming that you have one roster, one character. That's what this is assuming is it's one character per roster, which is clearly not the truth right so wait it gets better so then we're gonna take it up we're gonna step it up a notch bam i knocked it up a notch i'm gonna bam. knock it up another notch i gotta get this notch up knocking on film hey elzar think fast why you Elsar, and only people who are old enough to remember that will get that reference. But then we're going to take a look at this. We have now cut out basic arrays, and we now did a 60-40 split. And if you look over here, that's where I talk about this. Okay, I did a 60-40 split here. And with a 60-40 split in the market, still assuming that 60% of the players need uh, prime arrays. This is 60% of 35,000, right? And then 40% would now be 14,000 because you just combine these two. It's not complicated math. We would need, in that four-month period of time, you would need 78.4 million and we only produce 75.6 million. So you would be short Arrayas, right? Right here, superior Arrayas. And in that exact same time, we would need 281.5 million prime Arrayas and we would only produce 253.8 million. And now again, that's under the assumption that all of this player base, 35,000, was split into a 60-40 split and that these players at these different pools needed these Arrayas, okay? Now remember something though. To finally TLDR sum this up, this is actually a pretty quick video, I guess, because I put the legwork in. To sum this up finally, to finally sum all of this up, the reason why I know you're going to be short is because this was all done with the math and the assumption, two things. The assumption that all players, all 35,000 players actually do their trade skills religiously or efficiently, first off, which is like the most dramatic way i could sway this in your favor of believing that there is no doom or bottleneck coming so boy did i sway it in your favor but then the second massive sway in your favor and it still comes up short as you can clearly see which is hilarious because there's two massive mathematical sways i add to this is the final math now we split that roster into two right 50 50 what i did is i gave them three 1580s and i gave them three 1540 ranges right so i gave them two of those ranges and we did the math again all we had to do is multiply these numbers by three right and what we ended up getting i put it in blue here which i hate i hate that i put this in blue here because it's supposed to be purple but anyways in four months period of time you need per per character or, or i'm sorry per per roster you produce 75.6 million right or as a community we produce 75.6 million right and the community will need 235.2 million produced in four months to be able to get all of those people their three alts or whatever it is up to 1580 that's crazy right 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 it's three to one it's not even fucking close we won't even have anywhere close to the same amount but this is where it gets horrifying 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 because i'm pretty sure i did this math on 35,000, not even 21 but we're going to do it with this we're going to assume 21 here's your primer is in the next four months we're going to produce as a whole entire community assuming that th uh, 21,000 players are producing primer rays and doing their trade skills every single fucking day we're, we're assuming that okay that you're going to produce about 253.8 million. We need 844.5 million in the next four months. And you can go look at the max roll. You can corroborate my math however the fuck you choose to. We will need 844.5 million arrays. And that was the average scenarios for the record. That's not assuming if people bitty or one tap for that record. Right, and we will only produce 253.8 million. Now, for fun, I saved some fun math for the end because I thought this would be fun. Is we'll do 35,000. We'll actually assume that all of these players are now just contributing to the top and not to every other aspect of this branch, right? But let's just take the 35,000 for a second and we will assume. We will assume. Why not? We're going to say 35,000 so you can kind of see where the math came from times 405 per week, right? Or it equals 14.1 per uh, week. I'm sorry. So, Th that was already 35 x 35,000 okay so i don't need to do that because i already did 35,000 so we're just gonna we don't need to do 35,000 again but we're gonna do it anyways right 35,000 just so you guys can see it times 405 because you can produce about 405 of them a week times uh 4.5 weeks in a month times four months 
and there's your math. 255 million. It's actually, all right, so I was a little bit short when I said 253 million. So even if I assumed every single player in the entire economy was producing this, you would still come up short. And not by a little bit, but by a massive margin. And I fucking slanted these numbers so hard by assuming, again, 35,000 people do their trade skills, for, first off. And by assuming, again, that it's one roster, one character. So I, I, I slanted the shit out of this and you're still fucking wrong. If you can't see it now, that is your problem because there's a lot of smart people that are going to get this and they're going to understand it and it's going to influence the way that they play the game and the way they think about things. So to them, congratulations, you guys have been educated. Um, to the ones who still can't get it, go ahead and argue with me in the comments. I would have fun with this because this is actually hilariously so lopsided that I don't know how anybody can argue this. Now, let's we'll make it fun. We'll make it uh, a little bit more fun, okay? Remember that this number, 844 million, was based off of... 21,000 players, not 35,000 players. If we did 35,000 players times, uh, where are we? I have it written somewhere. Oh, fuck, I don't remember. Oh, right here, 13,000. Oof, oof, oof. It's right there. 13,400, which is the average cost to get to uh, 1630. That's the other thing. So I didn't even do 1650 for the record. I did 1630 because that's Voldyke, I think, right? Um, which is plus 21 on all your shit for the record, which is kind of crazy. 469 million that doesn't seem right oh right because then you would times it by three yeah 1.4 billion get the fuck out of here get the fuck out of here you're wrong not only are you wrong you're delusionally fucking wrong for thinking that there's not going to be a bottleneck you're crazy it just hasn't hit yet it doesn't matter it does not matter in the next four months this is what people will be able to produce period the fucking end even if I gave them an eight-month window, this is what's funny. We'll take that four-month window, right? Look at, oh, my God. Oh, my God, right? But let's just, for shits and giggles, that we'll take that $844 million and we'll say that's the number we're going to run with. We won't do it times the whole fucking roster, basically, like what I just did. Okay, we won't even do that. We won't even assume all the players are at that point. But look, just for shits and giggles, just for shits and giggles, we're going to take that $253 million or whatever it was, $255 million, right? And that was four months period. We're going to throw another four months on that, right? Which is eight months. So in the last eight months, if they were preparing for this like you believe they were, they're so smart. They've been thinking ahead. They really have. <laughs> That's why I was saying in that comment, like, you shouldn't be, you shouldn't have been making superior raises. When that kid Chris on the stream was making superior raises a couple weeks ago or a month ago or whatever, I thought it was stupid. Why was it stupid? Because you're taking away from the fucking pool that we're going to need, you dumbass. But yeah, go ahead. Keep listening to people like that. People that don't understand the knowledge that they have. They don't know how to fucking use it. You can have all the knowledge in the world. Hedge. It's hedging. It's classic hedging. Ha, 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 ha. Shut the fuck up. Please. God, I like you, but stick to what you're good at. Having fun on stream, on content. Not pretending that you actually can read this shit. Because you can't. Anyways, that was eight months. Wait a minute, though. That doesn't even hit it. We're still 300,000 short. So hold up, let's add, we'll just add another four months to it, which would be another 255, uh, 255 million. You guys already know this is going anywhere that gets basic math. We're still short. I could have gave you 12 months. I could have gave you a fucking year to produce this fish wise, to go down here, to be able to get whatever the fuck you need, 10,000 energy a fucking week, and you still would have came up short. It didn't matter even if you were preparing a year out in advance, you wouldn't have been able to prepare for this. Because why? Because you still needed fucking superior arrays. <laughs> Anyways, TLDR, you're fucked. Not only is the doom real, it's no longer a prediction. It's a mathematical calculation. Again, get this video in Smilegate's hands. Because one of two things is happening. Either they're intentionally slowing us down. Intentionally. And preparing us for a reset or something like that. And that, that's very possible, actually. So this could be a plan. They, they could actually be doing this intentionally to allow the lower half of the player base to catch up because if you look at what's needed for these lower half players, it's actually insignificant compared to what we need at the top end, right? Um, so that could be what's happening here. We could be watching them intentionally slow it down so new players can catch up and people can work on their secondary rosters or take a little bit of time off the game. I have no idea what their approach here is with this, okay? I really don't actually. But if that's not their plan, if this wasn't a calculated fucking decision and this is an oversight like I believe it is, they need to they need to address this. They need to address this and you should all be buying fucking prime arrays right the fuck now because before it's too late and you can't get any at all. Period the end.
I don't I don't know how else to spell it the fuck out for you guys. And if you, even if you do it on a basic level, even if you do it on a player to player level and you say, "Oh, I'll make my own arrows." Ah! Even if you do it on a basic level, we'll do a little bit more fun math on screen for you. Um, even if you do, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm having a ball with this because it's just like, how the fuck can any of you argue shit like this? You just don't get it. That kid that was like, the kid Neo, and I'm sorry, he's still in the Discord, but the kid Neo, I'll just throw gold at it and people can just buy the arrays. It's not even a problem. You, you, how delusional do you need to be to not understand the fact that you only get 11,000 energy of, of fucking every three days and it only farms this amount of materials? Like, you... Do you miss that bottom half? Like, do you think that we just produce? Do you not understand the semiconductor shortage in real life? Do you just not get that? Do you not get the coal shortage back in, like, I think it was the 60s or something like that, or, or whatever the fuck it was? Do you just not understand that if you don't have the raw materials in the bottom end of the fucking pyramid, that it doesn't matter if you have the gold to buy what's at the top end of the fucking pyramid? Holy shit, you ape. God. God help you, genuinely. Father, please, help these motherfuckers, like... They need you. <laughs> they need Jesus bad. But the, the, and I don't mean that in a meme. I actually really do believe uh, in God. So that, but it's just, it's funny. Like, it's hilarious. Like, I, somebody be, we mean the shit out of this video for these meatheads. Like, but anyways, we'll do some fun math. Because why not? That's who I am. So we'll pretend that you're one singular player. And you can produce about 405 of these a week, right? And you're doing it on your own. We're going to do 4.5 weeks times four because it's four months. You would produce 7,000. You need 13. You're still going to come up half short. So I'm not going to lie. That's actually the best route here is to not sell your shit and to produce your own shit. Um, but yeah, I mean, even that, you're still going to come up short. And I, I do have another video coming out. And hopefully nobody beats me to the punch and steals more of my fucking ideas for their content. But it's okay. Um, I don't care. Actually, I guess at the end of the day, it's just kind of dirty. It's like grimy. Like, come up with your own shit. Genuinely. Um, or, or, or hashtag me in it, like link me in it, like shout out to me and, and give me the fucking credit, you slumps. Um, but anyways, uh, there is an offset here, except I haven't seen them in the Amari shop yet, but I thought they would be in there, but there's an offset here, which is the paid to win aspect, right? Um, or blue crystals for materials, um, or blue crystals for trade potions and things like that. But again, I just want to say that this is a massive overset over, uh, or over, This is a massive lopsided mathematical equation and not even because again with the one one character per roster concept but because of this because we're assuming that all 35,000 players are doing their trade skills. You're also assuming all 35,000 produced the amount of trades the same amount. This was based on somebody that said he was using legendary and a couple purple swap outs a tool being efficient being efficient. I took the most efficient of all the data I looked at I took the most efficient trade skill production and i don't mean to do all of that i actually just meant to do this okay that was the most efficient person right so you have a lot of lopsided math here and you're still fucking wrong uh thank you guys for tuning in hit that like comment subscribe uh this has been another evolving mental moment um i don't know what to tell you i predicted it i seen it i seen it i saw it i saw it before you saw it because i understood this shit before you understood this shit it's a fundamental flaw of the game the ratios don't check out i don't know how else to say it to you there's a mix of accents there but um yeah i'm happy with that peace On the way, way, I want my revenge. Welcome to the payday. Hungry for destruction, crazy for the cray cray. Better clear the exits, make a way to vacate. Ready to raise your right, and I wanna raise a solid. Yeah, yeah, keeping the state and vibing as we feel a solid. Yeah, yeah, they wanna make the fire, quick in the cage of solid. Yeah, yeah, they wanna make them fly, you're gonna speak the fire. Yeah, I'm gonna write a new code, let's let the rules go. Show them why they name a public enemy, Uno. Yeah, they say we ruthless, we savage. Yeah, there's a method to the madness. They say we psycho, the baddest. Uh huh. There's a method to the madness. There's a method to the madness. There's a method to the madness. Yeah. Yeah. There's a method to the madness. Yeah. But there's a method to the madness. We gon' do it our way. Never needed the kudos. Kill him with the chaos. Only way that we do know. Lawless and ruthless. That's a dynamic duo. That we get the job done while you.
running your food home.